people! Hello and welcome to another edition of WWE Immortals. And why are we here? We're here for the dashing rogue, John Cena. The dashing rogue of a fella. Now, what have I done? As you can see, there's, what, 32 minutes to go. Now, those of you familiar with the game, you'll know that uh, there are five challenge levels you have to work your way through to get that evolved gold character, whatever the prize is. Now, we haven't had a chance to do much on this, which is why we're only on standard level. You know, it goes standard level, uh, expert level, and then nightmare level, which we have completed before. We just haven't had a chance this time around, because obviously there's other games that we play that you guys like, and uh, just haven't had a, ta a chance to uh, get stuck into this. We got stuck into it this afternoon, so the way I've left it, as you can see, challenge one is completed. Challenges two, three, four, and five have all got one bout to go to complete them. Now, again, regulars will know that if you look on the left, if you complete two challenges, you get a free bronze pack. Three challenges, that gives you 15k credits. Four challenges, as a free silver pack. And five challenges, you get that dashing rogue, Johnny Cena. So that's what the, the aim of the game is today. So I've deliberately left it um, that we can now go into each challenge, complete the line in each of those uh, challenges, and you can see me collect the rewards. Now, obviously, when you get on to uh, expert level, you know not only get another one of those uh, characters as the prize, you get a gear card. And if you go on to nightmare level, you get a third of those characters and you get a specific gear card to whichever character it is that you've just nabbed. But the important thing here is time is running out. So I'm very quickly, I've already uh, sorted out my team for here and this needed Kane. We needed to have Kane in uh, our setup here. So I'm going to try and play, I'm going to be tapping the iPad. I'm going to do my best to try and look at the monitor, because uh, that way I'm not looking down all the time. So I might go a bit pear-shaped. We'll start off with Macho Man against Biggie. I'm not a, not a great fan of those uh, Biggie characters, I have to say. They're a, bit, they're a bit bland. Not very exciting. Some of these characters, some of the moves are great, the graphics are great, the finishing moves are fantastic. The Biggie ones are uh, just a bit... Mm. So this is the man of the moment, Kane, passing back to... Randy, oh yeah! Right, and I've got Big Show, which just won't take too much work at all. Come on, lad, don't get caught. Right, block, block, block. Come on, Randy, do the stuff. Tap to attack, and victory is ours. Right. Okay. So as you can see, that was pretty simple. Not too much XP knocking around, but it doesn't matter. And uh, this should give us our completed challenge and a bronze pack. Now, bronze pack-wise, I haven't got too many level 7s, but I do have a Brie Bella. Level 7, why does that always happen? I'm pretty sure I've got Brie Bella. Let's have a quick check uh, in our collection. And there she is, level 7. So yeah, you can sell them off, but you never sell them off for as much as you'd have to pay for them. Uh, at least I didn't pay for a pack, I guess. And it, it hurts more when it's someone like Daniel Bryan, who've had about 20 times Legendary 7 on gold. Anyway, Challenge 3. Let's go in for Challenge 3. See what we can do. We don't have to change it. Oh yeah, we do have to change our team. Hang on. Uh, only bronze and silver characters. So, uh, just make sure that's... I might be a bit hasty here. I'm just like uh, sort of Brie on the brain. I'm just going in with bronze characters. I guess I could have put a silver character in, uh, which made it a bit quicker. It means we're going to have to concentrate a bit more, doesn't it? Concentrate what I'm doing. Come on, Brie. Come on, Brie. Against Broccoli Legions. Kane. No Kane, no gain. Come on, they're not exactly taking too much out of Brock here, are they? I didn't notice. Was Brock the biggest character? I hope so. I hope the others aren't going to be as resilient. Otherwise, uh, in the time I'm taking to do this, I could have uh, taken a few extra seconds and got a silver character as the main character in. But I didn't. So I have to make do with what we make do. Right. Uh, come on, hopefully. Is that going to see for him? Probably not, is it? Uh, it's going to leave him on the edge. He's left him on the edge! Right, there's another one of these Big E characters. Fairly bland, Big E's. Right, he's a flame. We are burning him. We are inflicting Banshee Rage. Go on, Paige, do it for Britain. No, that's, uh... 
He's not going to go lightly either, is he? One. Oh, another butt crack. Oh, come on. That's two of them now. That's two of them. Oh, am I right in saying Stone Cold's going to suddenly sap our, uh, sap our energy? Well, the police are coming. I'm going to be arrested for playing this. Oh, it's all gone horribly wrong. Come on, this is taking too long. And my blocking page. Get in there. Do some stuff. Do some shizzle. Right. The problem when they're locked, of course, is you can't just choose whoever's got their finishing move highlighted. Well, at this rate, they're all going to be down to, like, the last millimetre of life. It's dragging it out unnecessarily. Right, come on. This should do it. Come on. Butt crack. Right, I'm not going to waste a whole finishing move on a, someone on a butt crack, so we'll just do one on here. Right, that's one gone. Next up, sneeze. Sneeze on him. <laughs> do it. Gone. He's gone. And finally, that's got to be enough. That has to be enough. Rapid swipey swipey. And he's gone. Victory's ours. Well done, Paige. Well done, team. Queen of Ravens. Right, that was unnecessarily uh, hard. That's my own fault. Right, this will give us 15k credit, so at least there's nothing. We're not going to pause here. We're just going to scoot on to the next challenge. Yes, come on. Challenge four. We need Brock Lesnar in the team. We need to get Broccoli Legions. So we'll do a bit of editing. Find Brocky Boy. I'll actually make him the main card. Uh, may as well. The others can just sit in there. Get a bit of experience in the squad. Right, Brock should make easy work of this lot. Certainly a lot quicker than the last time around. And that'll give us a silver pack. See if we can have some better silver pack luck than we had bronze pack luck. Oh, we've still got plenty of time, I should imagine. It's probably still about 25 minutes. I didn't even check, did I? Probably still 25 minutes to go. Broccoli is going to make mincemeat of this lot. I like bringing Biggie Dude out for this challenge, don't they? Biggie, you're going to be marmalised. You're going to be brockled. Ground and pound. Tappity tap tap. I know you shouldn't hit a woman, but there you go. Take it with you. I'll just take it to go. Come on, Taker. It's a repeat of WrestleMania 30. Brock is on the verge of taking the streak. Doesn't matter how much he tries to resurrect, Taker's looking wobbly. Brockley Legions is about to step in and take the big prize and end the streak like the mean-spirited person that he is. Break the hearts of several nations. Right, now let's see what silver character we get. I've got quite a few that are doing okay. There's um, there's The Rock, there's Triple H. Uh, they could all do with... Uh, oh, Taker. That's quite appropriate, isn't it? That's Taker. Okay, well, let's have a look. I think he's um, it's on level 2 or level 3. So that's a nice little upgrade. If we go into our collection again. A collection. Where are you? Look, 10. Undertaker. There we go. And here we have it. Nice legendary two to legendary three. All right, now let's go and get our evolved John Cena dashing rogue. Now this needs Randy Orton in the team. Actually, it's an interesting point, Randy Orton. Um, they've had a few tweets here. I'm going to have to put Randy Orton in the team. Hang on. I'm trying now to grab my iPhone at the same time. Um, we need to put Randy Orton in the team. And... Uh, a few people, including, let me just get this, right, just put him in there, including, uh, who is it, uh, Paul Watchell, NFG Music on Twitter, um, uh, saying about people who have obviously cracked into the credit side of the game and have just creamed packs and packs and packs to get better characters, and some of the pictures he sent include... A person who's got a legendary seven, Randy Orton. Now, as I'm sure you're all aware, Randy Orton was only available from the starter pack, which had to pay, I think it was eight quid, ten dollars for. Um, and since then, uh, some people have said they've seen him appear in some gold packs, but to get another six Randy Orton uh, evolved characters, you would have had to have spent a shed load of credits. Shed load of credits. You've either got to be extremely rich when money doesn't matter. Or, which is probably more likely, uh, you cracked into the game. And uh, you can see it replicated when you see people's gear cards. And you see people at the top of these leaderboards and they've got gear cards 
sort of maxed out. Every card is evolved and maxed out. Now, I'm not saying that every single person there has cheated their way through, uh, and some people do have more money than cents, but uh, it's got to be worth raising the point to the game makers. And if you've had similar experiences, if you've seen people you think they must, they must have cracked into the game, let me know in the comments down below, because the more we talk about this and the more we raise awareness, the more the game makers will have to pay attention to what's going on. Because it does kind of ruin it for the rest of us. You're going into the online mode particularly, you want to get into those leaderboards, you want to get the high rewards, um, obviously, because uh, that you're going to get those special gear cards. And you're not going to get in that top three or top five if there are people occupying positions in there, positions in there who've who've hacked their way through to it. So just raising the point, just just raising the point. Right. So as I say, we dearly love, I so dearly love to have that Randy Orton card. And there's a, there's a new pack which we'll take a look at that's appeared after the latest uh, makeover which is a 600k pack, but we'll, we'll come on to that. Let's just do what we need to do to get Johnny Cena on our crew. So we're coming for you, JC. And the question is, I'm really not paying attention to time now, so I can't really risk it. I was going to perhaps let him do some of his finishing moves or some of his uh, special moves, but I think actually what we need to do is just get him, uh, have a quick look at him in our collection, then go and have a look at him in the store, because what it will do is unlock the character in the store. There you go, it didn't take any time at all, did it? Fairly simple. Uh, would have been a lot more challenging on Expert and definitely more challenging on Nightmare level. But again, it's doable. These things are doable. Uh, right, what we need to do is let it give us this card. Welcome to our crew, Johnny Cena. Come on. There he is, new card. A new card's been added to your collection. Confirm. I said... Confirmed. Have you seen her? Confirm. It's not good waiting around. And there we have it. You get 25 credits. Now, what have we got? 20 odd minutes. Well, we're not going to do that, are we? Uh, 20, uh, 20 minutes for expert level. Uh, not going to happen because there's, what, 48 bouts in the first four challenges and another 15 on top. So, 63 bouts. Uh, not going to happen. Well, it would be able to happen if this was like two days to go, but not going to happen now. But again, for those of you who have not seen it, that's what happens and you have a nightmare level should you complete that lot. You get John Cena and a gear card, as you can see, for, for winning this level. And you get John Cena and a specific John Cena card on the next level. So let's look at that collection and find Johnny C. There he is. Let's have a quick look, see what he can do. Oh, Cena Plex is no big surprise, is it? Cena lifts his opponent by the head and slams him into the ground. And he's level five, his strike they fall. Cracks their back. Yeah, that makes a change. And then when you get up to level 20, it's an attitude adjustment. You can't see him with his attitude adjustments. There's no surprises there, are there? Right, let's have a look in the store. Now, if you remember, when you've got characters in your collection, they're stored in alphabetical order. Uh, when you go into the store, well, look, there's that pack, 600k on then. When you go to the store, they're done uh, by bronze, silver, and gold for some reason. I don't know why they do that. Right, can you see the John Cena we've just cracked? There's the normal evolved character. Maybe he's at the end. Nope. Ah, there he is, top right. Johnny Cena, have you Johnny Cena? 236k. Right, let's have a look at him. Right, he's wearing some rather nifty cut off medieval gear. Yes, they always used to uh, cut it off in the midriff to show off their abs. I didn't worry about protection in those days because they were too good for their opponents. Don't worry about a silver sword going right through your middle. Right, and he's got more hair than usual as well, hasn't he, that Johnny Cena character? Bit more hair suit than one would expect of a GC. Okay, right, that'll do us. And um, that'll do us in general, I reckon. I'll just have a look at this, uh, this pack, this 600 pack. 600k pack, what have I got? 120k, just over 120k. That 600k pack, look at it. Contains a random selection of three, three rare characters. You're paying 200k a pop. It's still cheaper than it costs to buy um, the standard gold characters in the store. But that includes Randy Orton. It does include that Randy Orton. Right, people. There we stand. There we have it. It's John Cena, part of the Bad Lad Dad crew. Now, don't forget, if you want to find out about any of our videos that are coming out, whether it's uh, Immortals, whether it's WWE Supercard, whether it's... Uh, what else have we got? There's the Agario Blob Wars that Ninja Boy loves so much. And um, 
anything like that, even some FIFA 15 videos, and we'll be hitting on to FIFA 16 when it's released. Go to our Twitter account, which is at BadLadDad. If you want to see some behind-the-scenes pictures, that's on Instagram at BadLadDad. And if you haven't subscribed to us, go on, hit the red button, treat yourself, and follow us at BadLadDad on YouTube. See you soon.